guys, good morning. It is one very, very grey and miserable cold morning here in the north of the UK today. I'm going to start this vlog off on a bit of a downer and just show you that grey sky right there. There we go. Let me turn this down. Oh, look at that. Full on heavy rain and freezing. We've got all the lights on in the house this morning. We've got the heating cranked up. It is winter in here today. But we're just about to head out. We're just about to leave Prinny. You alright Prinny? Come here darling. Hello. Come here. I know I love you too. Yeah. You can look after my house. Yeah and be a good girl Prinny. Yeah, that's right. You look after the house and we'll be back soon, okay? So we're just about to leave the house. We're going up to see Nana, Sarah's Nana today. Um, we're taking her out for the morning slash afternoon for lunch like we do pretty much every week. We haven't been up for like two weeks, I think. Not last week, but the week before. So we're going up to go take her out somewhere just for a wander around. Maybe, maybe just to a shop, probably to get some shopping in or whatever. Somewhere indoors for sure. Definitely no walking outside today. Are you ready to go, Munchkin? I'm Looking to go. very cute in our merch top today. Dim, 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 dim. Even fit bumps. Even fit bumps. Oh, well, that's. Comfortably fit bumps. We're firing a plug, and I don't know what it is. That's going to sell it to the masses, that is. <laughs> Putting on a new coat. Oh, nice and what? Actually, I do, I do like this coat because it's reversible. I do think it's pretty cool. No, when you get one side dirty, you can just wear the other side. I've not had a reverse. Ew, you're gross. <laughs> that's what you do with your socks, isn't it? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> I've not had a reversible coat since I was like eight. So I'm very excited to wear this today. Nice. Are we ready to go? Yeah. Are we ready to go? Let's bounce. So we just picked up Sarah's Nana and we've just rocked up to a local B&M store just to have a little wander around and pick up a few bits for her. And I've found the best advent calendar I've ever seen so far in my hunt for an advent calendar. And I haven't got one yet, but I have now. Oh yes, look at that. My favourite chocolate bar in the entire world in an advent calendar. That's my Christmas made. Honestly, I can't even deal with how many nice looking things are in this B&M store right now. Look at this pack of nerds. It's literally as big as my head. It is massive. Guys, what do you think the chances are of me being able to find Chris and get him to buy this? <laughs> I need to go find him. It's huge. <laughs> Mission find Chris in b and Oh my gosh, I found him. Looking very serious right now, looking at some chocolates. Or some... Oh my gosh, his face is so funny. Let's see if I can film him. <laughs> Why so serious? <laughs> So he's been deadly serious right now because he's obviously found some of his favourites. Yeah, well, these are my favourite quality treats ever, these strawberries. Can you imagine if this was one big one though, like full of that fondant? Oh, so <sighs> good. A massive one. In our house at Christmas time, the strawberry creams and the orange creams always went in the bin. Nobody would eat them. That's crazy, man. They're the best ones. I know. Anyway, I found something amazing okay. for us to buy. Oh, no. Follow me. This is never good. No, this is good. Hi right, fam, we need to comment down below and tell them how good this is. Keep coming. Is it up there? No. Is it up that one? No. Oh, hang on. It's here. To the front garden. Yeah. No, Babe, man. who wouldn't want that in the front garden? Me, I don't want it. <laughs> yeah. Come off it. That's amazing. We're not getting either. Ho, ho, ho. It's time to go from the Take me right home. <laughs> So we were just looking at the novelty section in B&M, there's loads of really cool toilet roll things which is a bit random but it's funny for like a novelty secret Santa gift for someone and then we came across this <laughs> fishing for floaters <laughs> bathtub game it's absolutely hilarious and the more I thought about it the more I realised how much Esme would love that she would think that was the most hilarious thing. My nana's going to get it for her. That's so funny. So we did manage to escape being in without that big Santa sign being bought, although I can definitely see Sarah sneaking back there with my mum or otherwise to get that when I'm out sometime. So just pre-warned, Sarah. Don't bother. 
We've just come to Asda right now. We're gonna go get some grocery shopping in for Sarah's Nana. Probably hit the cafe up too because they do do the best pizza here ever. And that's always a treat when we come down to this Asda because they don't do it at every Asda. It's only certain ones. So I'm quite excited now. So I'm just in the changing rooms in Asda because my lovely Nana is insisting she buys me a jumper <laughs> for Christmas. So I just found this really cute purple one and I'm absolutely obsessed with this colour at the moment. And I can't seem to find anything I like in this colour. So I thought I'd go for this. Tell me what you guys think. Hang on. Be easy if I uh, turn it around and show you this way. As you can see, it accompanies my bump quite nicely. Yeah, I just, I really like it. I really like the colour. It's kind of a baggy one under the arms, which makes it super comfortable. And obviously because it's a high neck, it's really warm. I think I might get this one. I especially like that it's quite long. I often find with jumpers, they're really nice colour, they're a nice style, but they're so short on the body and when you're pregnant especially you don't want a jumper that's really short. So I think this is a winner guys. What do you think? Comment down below and let me know. So remember I said they do the best pizzas ever. Check this out guys. It's like a proper New York slice. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> herself all nice and ready for dance and we are about to set off because Esme has got parents evening tonight mm. and this is the first Daddy. no <laughs> and this is her first parents evening in her new school so I am very much looking forward to seeing what the teachers have to say hi everyone so I've just got back from school this evening it's really exciting because me and dad are actually going out to the cinema this evening to watch a movie um, I don't know what movie we're going to see just yet but we're gonna go have a look downstairs in a minute together to go see what awesome movies they have on today tonight sorry and I'm really super duper excited it's gonna be awesome also I had a pretty good day at school um, I had a maths test which didn't actually go that bad surprisingly because I am quite bad at maths it did go quite well and um, there are a few questions that did get stuck on but most of them were okay um, but yeah that's pretty much it I think I'm gonna finish off getting ready and do my hair because it's a big mess and I'll see you guys when we've picked a movie. So guys, as Isabel said, me and her are actually just getting ready to head out to the cinema tonight. So we thought instead of going to the skate park tonight, which we've done for the last two Wednesdays, that I'd actually treat her and take her to the cinema tonight. We're gonna go grab some food and then we're gonna go grab the film. But first of all, we need to go and get back to dancing because mom has gone to dancing with my wallet. Nice one, babe. Thanks for that. So we need to do a little detour back to dancing to grab my wallet. So I've got some money to pay for tonight, which... We kind of need, you know? Awesome man, right? We're gonna roll out, we're gonna nip to the shop and grab some munchies because I ain't paying no cinema price munchies. So we're gonna go to the shop and get some munchies in, right? Yeah. We always do this anyway. We've never, ever, ever paid cinema price Maltesers. Like, £3.50 for a bag of Maltesers? I don't think so. They're a pound in Asda. That's what we do. Obviously we get the usual popcorn and stuff from the cinema, but yeah. we ain't paying no chocolate cinema prices. All right guys, so we just got to the cinema. Bit of Odeon looks tonight. Isabel, what's the film called? We're seeing again. I think it's called um, Fantastic Beast. Fantastic. It's like a Harry Potter type You're film. Probably gonna be laughing at us right now. Fantastic <laughs> Beast. I'm gonna find out the name and, and update you in a minute because I have no idea what it's actually called. <laughs> the trailer looks ace for this film. Guess who's finally home from dance after the mammoth is dance session ever? And let me tell you guys, it is freezing out there tonight. Freezing. It's so, so cold. Look at me. Made you this school. Although, Perfect. I put two big bags of sweets in and it's only half filled it, so we need to buy another bag. Okay. I need the Friday, so that's fine. We've got just enough time. Just enough time. Did you have fun at dance? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what is Prinny doing? Prinny Prinny. <laughs> 
Oh, well, girls, I've got a little surprise for you. So go sit down near the Christmas tree. I didn't actually buy this surprise. One of our lovely iFam sent it to our PO box, but I just opened it today because it actually just came in an Amazon box, like an Amazon order. And I was really confused. Like, I've not ordered anything from Amazon. And I completely forgot that our PO box comes straight to our house now. It just gets delivered by Royal Mail as soon as it's delivered. To, as soon as it's delivered to them, it comes to us. Which is so weird and it takes some getting used to because obviously before it went to the storage unit and then it, we'd have to wait until we went there. Anyway, what am I talking about? This big box arrived today and I opened it and I was like, oh my gosh, do you know how excited you're about to be girls? This is something you've really wanted, but you've never had. I've, n I've never bought you one, even though I know you really want one. <laughs> They're both like, right, stay there. Hang on a second while I just put the camera down. <laughs> okay, there is one for Isabel too, but obviously Isabel's out with Dad this evening. So we'll give you yours. Right, close your eyes. <laughs> yeah. Are they really close? Yeah. Keep them really, really tightly closed. Crazy girls. Okay, you can open. Because you've been desperate for one. <laughs> because they've both been desperate for one of these, haven't you? Before we open this. They do, and don't like, we? On videos, it looks so big. Am I putting it <laughs> Wait a minute, wait a minute before we open it. Before we open that one minute, girls, we need to say thank you because in this box of goodies, there's also one for Isabel, as you can see. <gasps> I know. Oh, it's for Egbert. It's for Egbert. It's so cute. Oh my god. Is that a slime bag? Slime bag. <laughs> but yeah, there's this really cute braces outfit for Egbert. There's some of this slime bath for you girls and then there's a super cute snow coat for him as well which is so so sweet so we need to say a big thank you to kylie miles thank you kylie miles <laughs> you want to open them then yeah. this is such a special treat for a wednesday night yeah. you girls are very very extremely lucky unroll here ah yeah unroll there isla i already opened my top roll it all the way around Oh, yeah, see, if it wraps her, like you unwrap, you get like a slimy Oh, Ah, that's cool. Ooh, I think it's a spoon maybe or something. No, it's a, it's is every spice of it. What was you saying, Esme? This is an ingredient. Yeah, it's an ingredient. Ah. I've seen one of these videos of these. Unicorn magic! Unicorn magic! Well, no, that one is a bit of a glitch or something. Yeah. They're cool, so is the thing stuck to the packet? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they're really nice. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna open my bottle first. Oh, yeah. Are you so excited right now? <laughs> Poopsies! Instead of Pepsi! Wipe castle. <laughs> oh, a cup. Oh, wait. I'm not sure. I think this is what you put. Make the slime. Oh, my poops is here. I've got it now. Wait, is this oh, it? What? <gasps> oh, that's cool. Oh, it's a little pug doggy. That's really cute. And you can, like, let's see what I got. Yeah, you can, they're like, okay, I should put this in my school bag. Kyla. goodness guys we're literally just making up this slime hang on a second Isla and I said to Esme as we were opening the unicorn fingers. food so it's called Esme open that very carefully because I don't want powder going everywhere and then I did this <laughs> straight, <after. laughs> straight down my legs all over the carpet all over the table all up my arm 
and it went right in my face as well. <laughs> nice. I did just want to take this opportunity to say a massive, humongous thank you to Kylie for sending the girls these poopses. They've been waiting for one since they first came out. And I thought the, the first <clears throat> one we'd ever get was on Christmas, maybe. Yeah, they've both got them on their Christmas lists and they thought that was the first time they were going to get one. And yeah, I just wanted to say it was a really nice surprise getting that in the post today. So thank you so, so much. And also just to say anybody else that's watching this and thinking, oh no, I should go and buy them something. Please don't feel like that. We don't need any sort of gifts at all from you guys other than you just watching our videos and enjoying them that's all we want but yeah the girls are just waiting for their slimes to settle now they've gone and put on their onesies the camera's blurry oh there we go i'm a princess poop yeah so basically you get like little little slime things that you can store inside these key rings <laughs> you pull it and then all your It's hard being in six, there. isn't it, Isla? Yeah. And you're not nice slow. There was a little girl who had a little curl right in the middle of her forehead. <laughs> <laughs> but when, once we've done this, we're going to go to bed. But I did also just want to say on the camera very quickly how proud we are of little Esme tonight because we had parents evening it wasn't like a normal parents evening we only saw her maths teacher we've got another parents evening tomorrow where we'll see her form tutor and find out a bit more but today we saw a maths teacher and it was really 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 good and she's doing really 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 well she struggles slightly with her digits and knowing where to put the digit in big numbers and like the tens and units but that she's trying really really hard Yes, I am. Trying really hard, and yeah, she's just doing really, really well. So we are very proud of you, Esme. What is on the telly right now? Waste diving. <laughs> Dad put this on so that Prinny's not sat in silence back in the time that he left and we got home. <laughs> she was on her own for about 45 minutes, so he puts TV on so she's not in her own. Anyway, yes, well done, babe. Very proud of you. Oh, yes, Isabel. These seats look boss. They're so nice. This cinema's changed a lot this, since this last time. Like just had like the regular um, black seats, but now they're like... Hello, we've got them recliners on, we've got little tables like... going on. <gasps> yes. <gasps> it started. <gasps> so it's half past nine and our film just finished. It was quite long, but it's it was like actually really good. Yeah. It was so good though. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I think, I feel like there's going to be like loads of series like the Harry Potter series, because it's like... Definitely. There's one before that, and then it ended with something yeah. that I feel like would have to carry on. Yeah. So if it didn't, it'd just be like, come on, guys. Anyway, <laughs> it was really good. Oh, it's really cold it. out here, Isabel. It's absolutely freezing. They've got grit down on the ground everywhere right now. That's how cold it is. I wouldn't say I'm necessarily the biggest Harry Potter fan, like, ever. We used to watch it a lot, like, when we were younger. We've but... watched them and stuff, like, but I don't think I wouldn't, like, go to watch a Harry Potter film, but I did really enjoy that. It was really good. Go see it. Anyway. It is late, so we're going to bounce back and get ourselves to bed. Oh. I know the girls have been having tons of fun at home because Sarah's been texting me some pictures that I've just picked up <laughs> when we've come out of the cinema. But yeah, we are going to go home and we'll see you there. So it's me and Isla have both just gone upstairs and got themselves into bed. I think Chris and Isabel are both on their way home. So I'm going to end today's video here because I'm about to jump in the shower and get myself into bed too. We hope you've all really enjoyed watching this video. And we'll see you all again tomorrow at 5 p.m. So just before we end this video, I wanted to really quickly tell you guys about our Black Friday madness that is going to be happening this weekend, all weekend long, all the way till Monday. So you will be able to have lots and lots of chances to go onto our store, the iFanStore.com, and pick up any iFan merch that you may like to do so. There is going to be tons of amazing discounts on there on all of our products, plus freebies given away with some purchases as well. There's gonna be lots and lots of crazy stuff going on there this weekend. So make sure you head over to the iFamStore.com. It's gonna be down below and on the screen too. And also if you're on Instagram, you can follow our new Instagram merch page at the iFam store and keep up to date with all of our latest news on all of our merchandise and products that come out and definitely our Black Friday sale, which will be going on there by the time you're watching this or certainly around this time anyway. It will be going on there and you will be able to check out all of the information to do with that and check out all of the deals that will be coming up. It is going to be crazy. But on that note, 
I'm gonna say good night, I'm gonna get a cup of tea and head up to bed and finish up our series that we're watching at the minute called The Sinner, season two, which is amazing and one of the last episode. And last night it was the biggest cliffhanger I've ever had on a series ever. So I can't wait to go check it out. So until tomorrow night at 5 p.m., we will see you then. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up if you loved it and we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, guys.